Yo, what's going on guys, King and Ten here, I'm back with a brand new video, today I'm going to be doing a Q&A for 2,000 subscribers. Um, as you know guys, I hit 2,000 subscribers uh, last week, and I asked you guys to leave some questions down in the comment section on that video, and all my other newest videos. But before we get into the video, could you smash like, uh, 10 likes, well me a lot, and subscribe if you're new to the channel, so you don't miss any content that I post, if you're on Android or iOS device, make sure you hit the little bell on my channel, so you get notified when I have a brand new GTA 5 video, or any videos like this. But anyway guys, let's get straight into today's video, so, I told you guys to leave some questions on my, uh, 2000 subscriber video, and my recent videos, um, that I upload, and you guys left some good questions, so we're gonna get straight into them. So the first question I got from was Ninja Gaming HD, and he said, uh, my question is what made you start YouTube? What made me start YouTube was basically because I played uh, GTA back in 2014. This was before I started like, um, like YouTube, like I started YouTube, um, like near the end, like a couple of months, um, near the end of, uh, 2014. And I thought I'll get into doing YouTube and like that i think it was most of the game that got me to start making videos about it and i quite like making videos guys it's pretty fun it is entertaining to kind of make videos and you do have a lot of fun doing it but it's quite hard so that's kind of what made me got into youtube i thought the game i don't know who inspired me though that's the thing so the next question is from chris games he said q and a do you ever plan of changing or ever playing other games other than gta that's a good question. I may be playing on um, Battlefield 1 and Watch Dogs on my channel soon, um, if I ever get the game. I'm hoping to change to console as well, maybe um, Xbox One and play there. There are some games that I do love on the Xbox One. There is uh, Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon that's coming out this year as well. I've never played any of the Tom Clancy games, but I'm hoping to play that as well. But E3 was a good like lineup for games that I'm that I had to think about and I'm thinking that game's good, that game's good, I will play those games. So yeah, I will be changing the content up very soon, but just not now because the games have not been released. Next question is from Chris Games and he said, um, Q and A, will you ever be doing a setup video um in the future? Um, well, I'm not really too sure about that because my setup is quite a mess at the moment. I'm trying to clean everything up, trying to get a new computer. My PC that I'm running right now is quite efficient, to be honest with you guys. Uh, well, but I will be trying to get a new PC and I will be trying to fix my desk and everything else up. To try and, like, show you guys that you don't need that much stuff to do YouTube. Like, you don't really need, um, that much stuff. Like, you don't need, a, like, a freaking 2k setup like that costs like two thousand um, dollars or pounds whatever so yeah i will be doing a setup video very soon but just not now maybe at 3.5k uh, so the next question is from jay-z um he said what made you want to do youtube and why um this was like the question that um, i had before and i think it was just because um uh, just the GTA, like when people upload GTA videos, they do get quite a lot of views. And as you may know, GTA is one of the best selling games during 2015 and 2014. And it's still one of the best games I like playing. I do have quite a lot of fun playing the games, even when there's new DLC content out. I always like to showcase it to you guys. That's what kind of makes the channel grow and it kind of makes it fun for you guys. Like you guys want to watch GTA content, so I'll bring it. So yeah, I think that's what made me start YouTube. Um, but I think I will, um, like, start to upload more content other than GTA, but who knows. Next question is from Bob HD, and he said, what game are you most excited for for this year? So, as you may know, guys, E3 was just, um, like, a couple of days ago. Whenever you're watching this video, it will be on the Sunday. Um, but E3 was just past there, and a lot of you guys were quite hyped for all these new games. Um, I think I remember... Uh, watching the conferences and I quite like the um, Battlefield 1 Ghost Recon and Watch Dogs. Now bear in mind these weren't actual gameplay trailers. Uh, these were just um, like these were just like trailer like these were like cutscenes and everything like that. But I was still excited for Battlefield 1 and Watch Dogs because those are the games that I didn't play most of the Battlefield games or the Watch Dogs the very first one. But I always wanted to play the second one because the second one obviously it would have been better and it's good like these old games were on the like 360 and you weren't really gonna have a lot of fun with them because there wasn't really a lot of people playing so because it's on next gen and because it's on the ps4 
I will have more people to play with on there and you know it'll be quite funny to do live streams on it. So yeah. So the next question is from No Grand Game and he said do you plan on changing and altering your channel content to make it more entertaining? And that is a really good question. Um that kind of revolves around changing like games and um, if if I'll be doing like games or even other videos other than like gaming videos, like if I would ever do vlogs, even doing like challenges on my channel. Um and I don't know, maybe soon if we do get a lot more support in the videos and a lot more shares we might be able to do more like challenges uh maybe in like gaming challenges when we play a game and we've got to do a challenge with it maybe something like that will be quite fun for you guys and you know you guys get quite entertained by watching that kind of stuff but who knows guys we i might change the channel content very soon thank you no grand for your question thank you everyone for leaving your questions it does mean a lot so let's get into the next one so the next question is from inspire tv and he said, how did you become a successful YouTuber? So, how I became a, an successful YouTuber is basically you just need to upload good content. Well, you need to have some good thumbnails, good standout thumbnails like mine. Um, as you know, I have like the thumbnails in blue. I'll start changing those up once in a while. I'll try and make them look better. Um, in the best way I can do possible, um, what I like to do is um, I like to kind of make them look nice. The program I do use to make these thumbnails is Photoshop. It is the only program that everyone uses to make their thumbnails. Other people might do it differently, but I like using Photoshop because it's more easier and I can make them nicer. And you need to have a good channel art, like a good banner and logo, a good standing out one like mine. I made mine, and I know it's kind of a copy for me in focus, and a lot of people have that now, but it's the best way of standing out on your channel. And yeah, and you do need to make some good videos, you need to make some good loud clear videos. I don't really make loud clear videos, I kind of had to, um, I kind of screwed up most of the audio in my last video. But you need to make your videos loud and clear, make it where your audience can understand what you're saying, and kind of make it good. So that's kind of how I've became big, I've been kind of putting giveaways as well, I kind of promote giveaways and stuff like that. That's how I've gained as well. So thank you for your question, Spire TV. Um, I got another question from Exojake, he put, how big do you think you'll get on YouTube? So I don't know guys, um, because I've hit 2k, I'm thinking about like how big I'll get if I hit 3k, and then 4k, and then 5k, 5k is the like, half of 10k, that will be a big milestone for me if I ever hit 5k. Um, there's always this thing I've always like imagine if you ever hit 5k you know you're gonna hit 10k if you ever hit 10k you know you're gonna hit 15k so think about that way guys i'll probably hit 5k soon but i think that's the biggest i'm gonna get maybe 10k as well but i don't know but the next question is from z kush apex he put hashtag q uh, q a who inspire you to do youtube um but i don't have really an inspiration of who inspired me to do youtube um i think it was just basically Upload GTA, playing the game itself, upload what other people uploaded, that's kind of what got me to do YouTube. But I used to kind of watch like the Saints fan and Miss Boss the Wing quite a lot. I still watch them quite a lot, like most of the DLC videos, but I think it was most of the game that got me inspired to do YouTube. So yeah. And the final question is from Majestic Games. He put how did you get into modding glitching? So I just want to tell you guys Modding was quite big during 2014 and 2015. Um, I used to get into quite a lot of money lobbies and, um, you know, like, money lobbies. Like, I used to get modders to, like, drop me money on the 360. And I did get banned once on the 360 and that was it. And then after that, I was still in money lobbies as well. But I don't know how I got into glitching. I got into glitching when I got my PS4 back in December. So it's been, uh, nearly six months now I've been doing glitches and... I gotta tell you guys, it's, pr it's actually blown the channel out quite a lot, and yeah, and I'm hoping to try and bring different content to the channel, um, like other than glitches, maybe still play GTA, but all, like other things to do in GTA, I did upload like how to make money fast and easy, you can check that out as well. But anyway guys, that's been the questions, um, so thank you guys for leaving your questions, um, it does mean a lot. You can leave more questions down in this video if you want to, if you want me to do another one of these videos. Um, leave a like if you want me to do another video like this. I just want to let you know guys, the Mario account giveaway is finished that I was hosting. So yeah, 
But anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed today, today's video, make sure you do leave a like on it. And subscribe if you are new to the channel, so don't miss any content that I post. But anyway guys, I'll see you guys in the next video, peace and have a good day. Peace.